Welcome back to How to Buy a Home in Colorado Springs. What is buyer's agency? Well, I'm going to share that with you right now. Hi, I'm Nettie McElhaney. I'm a realtor with Berkshire Hathaway Home Services, Rocky Mountain Realtors, here in Colorado Springs. Feel free to read the complete blog post by clicking on the link below. And don't forget to hit to click the subscribe button and the bell to be notified when I post more videos about real estate and lifestyle in the Colorado Springs area. After watching this video, be sure to click the link below to download my new home buyer's guide. It takes you through the entire buying process. But first, back to buyer's agency. Let's get started. In Colorado, we have three primary types of agency. We have a buyer's agent, a seller's agent, and a transaction broker. Let's start out talking about buyer's agency. A buyer's agency agreement is between a real estate agent and a buyer who is wanting to buy a home. To state it simply, the agent works solely on behalf of the buyer to promote the interests of that buyer with the utmost good faith, loyalty, and fidelity. The agent negotiates on behalf of and acts as an advocate for the buyer. A contract signed between the buyer and the agent spells out the duties and obligations of the agent and of the buyer. The agent must disclose to potential sellers all adverse material facts actually known by the buyer's agent, including the buyer's financial ability to perform the terms of the transaction and if the buyer intends to live in that property. Another thing to note is that as a buyer, you do not pay for the buyer's agent representation. Yep, that's right. This representation is totally free. The payment of your representation comes from the seller. So now let's talk about the seller side. A seller's agency agreement is between a real estate agent and someone who is trying to sell their home. The agent or listing agent works solely on behalf of the seller to promote the interest of the seller with the utmost faith, loyalty, and fidelity. The agent negotiates on behalf of and acts as an advocate for the seller. A separate listing agreement is required which sets forth the duties and obligations of the agent and the seller. The seller's agent must disclose to potential buyers all adverse material facts actually known by the seller's agent about the property. In this agreement, the seller sets the listing price and they both agree on the amount of the listing agent's commission. This commission is then split between the buyer's agent and the seller's agent when the property is sold. So what happens if I go to an open house? and the listing agent of that house says that they can represent me. Can a listing agent represent both me and the seller? Well, yes they can, but not with the same amount of fidelity. This type of agency is what we call a transaction broker. The transaction broker assists the buyer and the seller through the real estate transaction by performing the terms of any written or oral agreement, fully informing both parties, presenting all offers, assisting the parties with any contracts, including the closing of that transaction without being an agent or an advocate for any of the parties. Did you get that last part? Your agent in this transaction broker relationship is no longer your advocate. Now, the agent must still use reasonable skill and care in the performance of oral and written agreements and must make the same disclosures about all adverse material facts known by the transaction broker concerning a property or a buyer's financial ability to perform the terms of a transaction. So yes, an agent can represent both you and the seller, but you lose the advocate part of the relationship. Now, I'm not saying that a transaction broker relationship is bad, but if I was a seller and I was paying an agent a commission to represent me, I would not want to lose that loyalty that I'm paying for. 
Now, if you are a first time home buyer, I happen to have a new home buyer's guide and I would be happy to email it to you. Just click the link below. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. I release new videos every Thursday about real estate and lifestyle in the Colorado Springs area. Thank you for watching.